Hey, what is going on, you guys? This is Joe from Fluent Review, bringing you It's Gay Wednesday, episode 5. And these episodes have been doing pretty well so far, almost 100 views on each of them. So let's get started with you guys' Is It Gay topics. Now, this one's just a little personal question ish kind of thing, because I talked about gamer tags last week. And uh, this guy, you chill in one for one, something like that. So I don't know. Um, is my gamer tag gay, Madman141? And, um,. And the fact that I kind of like Madman, you know, it's fine. I mean, it's not gay or anything. It's fine. I mean, it's not like, oh my God, you're Madman, and not like that's an amazing gamer tag. But I mean, it's it's, it's a fine gamer tag. But the one for one, I mean, that that's fine too, I guess. I mean, I don't really like the random numbers, but um, I mean, it, one for one, it's not too random or not too complex. There aren't any X's. I'm happy. But the only thing is, like, what does one for one mean? Because I've noticed a lot of people have one for one in their um. Uh, gamer tag. So I mean, I I I, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I'm gonna skip some of these just because, again, they're getting too sexual. And for all I know, my sister could be watching this, and that just make it awkward. Um, so yeah, maybe in the future, but I mean, I mean, not right now. I, I some of these are really tempting actually, but uh, I I don't really want to put that out there, you know. Um, <laughs> Mikey N54 Michael Skating is his YouTube channel, which he doesn't make videos. Enters in, is it gay to compare dick sizes with your friends? Um, you know, if that's what you're doing in your free time, go for it. I don't really care. Not that I've done it, not that, uh, I mean, well, if you guys are really that interested and none of you guys give a crap, it's probably gay, but whatever. Who cares? If you, if you guys don't think it is, then that's an opinion. Really, gayness is pretty much an opinion. I'm giving you my opinion, and um, I think it depends on the situation, like pretty much all of these. And, by the way, I, I'd like to do more dual, dual comms um, with this, because I think it's more interesting, especially with the real-world examples, um, to have two different opinions. I'm good with answering all the quad uh, the COD stuff on my own, because I have no doubt in my mind about any of that. And, you know, I, I like to have two, two opinions on this real-world wor stuff. So, um, okay. Is it gay to drink MTN Dew, or Mountain Dew? I, I like to say MTN, because it's cool that way. Um... Code Red, like Code Red, the red flavor, and that's sent in by Makilla421, otherwise known as 420, why don't you just make it a zero, Makilla, why don't you make it a zero, Makilla, I don't understand, she could be a stoner bro, <laughs> um, no, I love Mountain Dew, I love Mountain Dew Code Red, and I just had this new Mountain Dew whiteout, and it's freaking awesome. And apparently, like, people decide right now, like, everybody in my family's like, oh my god, my, my pop is so unhealthy. I'm like, I know, I don't give a crap. I mean, I give a crap, but I mean, it's good. And I feel like drinking it, and I don't really care that hard. So, yeah, my parents are kind of freaking out, and they're like, you shouldn't drink pop anymore. I'm like, I don't care, I can stop if I want, but I don't want to. <laughs> um, I'm not sure what I was talking about. Well, Joven, is it gay if your parents take away your PS3 for a year for failing algebra? Um, no. Ah, oh, damn it. I'm sorry. One second, I'm going to cut the clip really fast because my mic isn't on and you probably heard terrible quality for the first part of the video. Sorry. There, now it doesn't sound like I'm film recording this with a soup can. Um, so, now this topic, it, it depends on the situation. Um, I, I, I kind of want to know what grade you're in. Slash, like, what, what year in high school or just grade in general. I'm going to assume you're either in, like, sophomore year-ish or, like, even in middle school somewhere if you failed algebra. And then here's the thing on this. I, I'm going to say if it's gay, if you know that it, you're failing it not because you're addicted to PS3, then it's not, then it's gay that they took it away. But if you're failing because you're playing too much Call of Duty, then yeah, I don't think it's gay at all. Because, to be honest, it, it, to fail any class is almost really, is in my opinion, really difficult. I don't know if you mean that you're actually failing it, but I mean, it's pretty difficult in my opinion to fail a class. You have to try pretty much. I mean, it's hard. I, I'm I've never gotten a C in a class. Um... I've gotten, yeah, I've never gotten a C, except in math when I was in, like, extended math, and then I dropped down. Now I'm in, like, honors. So, you know, bro, just work on your math, bro. Math is, I don't know, I don't know what to say else, but it's not, I don't think it's gay. Maybe for a year, that's a little crazy. I mean, I'm gonna, I guess it's gay. They should probably let you have it on occasion. 
um, on the weekends or something during um, summer. But I guess you'd have to learn your lesson too. Aqua Teen Hunger Force. And I love that show, by the way. Um, okay, so that was your answer to that. Um, was it gay to kill people with equipment and infected on Call of Duty MW3 before the patch? And I think that they st you, still, you still can, I think, with the... Um, uh, with the, um, freaking buses, or the cars and stuff, which is a good thing. And no, it's not freaking gay. If you know Jove, it's not freaking gay. Sent him by Nibja Tiger 551 Um, no, it's not gay at all. It's good. It's good. That's what the campers deserve. And, um, I did have this great series, but I accidentally deleted it. I did a live commentary session where I actually, I will admit it, I was lag switching just to kill the campers. I did that. Um, and it was really funny to hear the reactions. Um, I only did it to kill the campers. It was really funny. And, um, using equipment to kill campers is amazing. And that was freaking awesome when you could do that. I support it all the way. And to kill campers, hell yes. I mean, if you're a rusher and you get killed by equipment, that's unfortunate. But just get over it. Um, is it gay to rage quit if you're not host, Mr. Codfan2? I don't, what's the difference? Rage quitting is awesome in general. Um, is it gay? No. Um, <laughs> is it gay to have a shower after gym class uh, where you don't get sweaty and when you don't get sweaty? Oh, so it's basically have a shower after gym no matter what is basically what he's saying. Well, myself, I... Typically, there is a shower in the uh, locker room, and I think it's kind of gay because just in general to take a shower because pretty much nobody does it unless you're on the football team or something and you just do it all the time or something. Like, most people don't unless they just feel like it, and I, I never have except for swimming, and um, I, I'd say it's kind of gay in my situation to just do it in general. Um, but, I mean, not really. I don't know. But, I mean, if... I don't know, maybe you're just, like are obsessed with showering or something that you have to go well i mean it's kind of i don't know how to answer this at all i'm sorry great time to be gay uh this is a great time to be gay to shower after <laughs> I don't know, whatever um <laughs> mikey skating is it gay to hit the showers after football um well i think that you guys are all bros and you guys have just had a n nice or a uh, long session of um hard work and uh you know after a good game you know you just gotta hit the showers man just gotta hit the shower, it's not gay. Um, Kenneth WTF uh, asks, is it gay to wear v-necks? And I always claim that it is gay. And it, it's not really, but it's gay. Um, I don't know what to say about that. If it's a deep V, yeah, that's pretty gay. But I mean, if it's just like a casual V, um, like just casual, not too deep, not not deep at all, just like kind of as deep as it normally would go, then I think it's fine, especially if it's a sweater or something, it's fine if it's a V, but I mean, if you're going to have a deep V t-shirt, that's kind of gay, that, that that is gay, okay? Um, I think that might be it for this video. Is it gay to troll Fluxus on Twitter? Hell no, keep on doing it, Makilla, I love you. Um, eight, wait, Bulldog, your birthday's really on April 20th. I love you. I'm going to, you know, just for you, I'm going to upload the best internet video just for you on that day. It's going to be, have to do with 420 though, in a way. Um, is it gay to be Zergriz? Um, and the fact that Mr. Polo, you mean by being fat, then I mean, it's not technically gay to be fat, but I mean, it's kind of, you know what I'm saying. Is it gay to corner trap people? On Call of Duty. Hell freaking no. If you're in a corner, you deserve to be trapped there for life. I think there should be sticky glue in every corner on Call of Duty. So if you go in a corner, you're just stuck automatically. You don't even have to get corner trapped. That's a good idea. And then they make it so player collision actually pushes people. So then I could push people into corners if they were like camping. And then, and then I would be unstoppable. Um, I think that is it. Um, is it gay? One last one. Uh... The last one was sent in by Legit Scar. I, I forget to say the name sometimes. I mean, do you guys really care that much? I mean, if it was White Boy, of course, I would want to be called, which he has. But, um, 
he has said my name in a video when I was on his top five plays. But, I mean, do you guys really care that much when I say your name on the video? I mean, I don't know. So, is it gay to like show tunes? And I like some. I mean, Bowling for Soup does a lot. So, I, I like it. I mean, it's not gay. I mean, this was an alright episode. Enter more questions in down below. And expect some next week. Um, yeah. So, uh, talk to you guys later. Any suggestions for this video would be greatly appreciated. Bye.